This is the first night movie theaters in counties in phase two can reopen. There are, of course, a lot of new rules. King 5's Tony Black went to the historic Admiral Theater in West Seattle, where everyone is glad to be back. <laughs> yeah, good evening to you. They had about 12 people show up for their first showing today, which they tell me isn't bad, even on a non-pandemic day. And since then, there has been a steady flow of customers coming in and out, doing something that they haven't been able to do in close to a year come out and see a movie. Honestly, I've had phone calls from people just calling and saying, we're glad you're open and then hanging up. Marina Konsenko is happy to be back doing her general manager duties at the now open again Admiral Theater in West Seattle. There's a lot of parents um, just going crazy and calling and you hear the kids screaming in the background on the phone just to get people out of the house and see if we have a kids movie. Friday is the first day theaters could reopen in the seven counties that have moved on to phase two of the state's reopening plan. A long time coming for movie fans Jamie and Izzy. Our tradition for the last couple of years has just been like catching a movie Friday night, so it's like yeah. we really miss this. As part of phase two, movie theaters can now open at 25% capacity. That means at some theaters you're going to be separated by the number of seats or rows depending on the size of your party. And some of the showings include concessions or no concessions if you're concerned about safety. We're also offering 12 o'clock no concession shows. So people who don't want to be in the theater with people eating and taking their masks on and off don't have to do that. Marina says they sanitize each theater after every showing and an HVAC system filters clean air throughout. It's efforts that gave Izzy and Jamie confidence to come back. I think I would be a lot more nervous for like any of the big chain movie theaters and mm -hmm. stuff. I think that it was worth it for us just because it was something mm -hmm. that we've been doing for so long and yeah. it was just, it's all about supporting local businesses. And it's that community support Marina says they're banking on. They come here for the experience, you know, to hear like, to feel that sound in your chest and to sit down and smell popcorn and be around other people. It's social, just like when you go to a restaurant. Now you may notice that some of the last showings are at six o'clock and that is because they simply do not have the staff to have a later showing, so they will stick with these three daytime showings for now. Here in West Seattle, I'm Tony Black, King 5 News. Tony, thank you.